Hi, this is Ken with Village Green, and I am giving you your latest quick tip. This one is on a spring weed called Poa Anio. So this weed is called Poa Anio, and it is a very common weed for us to see in, uh, in early spring on into mid spring. Uh, it is a grassy type of weed but you'll see that it's got these little seed heads on it. This is a weed that comes up from seeds from the prior year. So this is called an annual type of weed. Um, and the thing with this, this is actually my side yard. And the question is, we put down a pre-emergent, so why do we have weeds still in, in the yard? The reason in this case is that uh, the, the sprinkler system here on this side, we just recently bought the home, and the coverage over here isn't quite as good as in some of the areas. Uh, and we'd have to completely redo this, the sprinkler system on this side to fix that, and we just haven't gotten to that yet. So the, the thing is with the pre-emergent, what happens is when we, when we apply it, the technician, you'll, you'll see the technician using a spray gun, and the, the, uh, the pre-emergent comes out in big droplets that hit the ground. The reason for the big droplets is that uh, with that, the wind doesn't blow it around as, as he's spraying it, so, so it goes straight to the ground. The thing is, though, when it hits the ground, it's still in those droplets. So what has to happen is that the sprinkler system needs to, uh, needs to go off and needs to, we need to this watered in doesn't have to be right away but within a week or two we need to have it watered in if it doesn't then uh, then the pre-emergent just disappears in this case what's happened is that while the sprinkler system did run the coverage wasn't good uh, so so those big droplets didn't get spread around and the, the pre-emergent didn't create the barrier that, that we'd like uh, the other thing that that can cause a breakthrough on on this particular weed uh, is uh, is if we have really heavy rains like we've had this year uh, and if it pools in an area then what happens is it pushes that pre-emergent deep into the soil and then it's no longer effective at the level where the seeds are growing so a lot of times we'll see a little bit more uh, a few more weeds say in the channels where where an edger is run uh, because the the water builds up right in there and, and breaks the pre-emergent down or pushes it too far down. So this weed, as you've seen in, the, in my lawn, uh, and we also do the neighbor's lawn here, uh, that we get really good coverage for the most part with the pre-emergent. We prevented, I'd say 98% of it in my yard. It is a little bit of an annoyance when we have this kind of a breakthrough. Uh, but as soon as we have warmer weather, this will burn off and, and go away. So it's, it's not it's not a huge problem. This is not a, a forever weed. It, it just shows up for a few weeks. So this is Ken with Village Green giving you your latest quick tip on, on weeds here. And if you like these quick, quick tips, please tell your friends and neighbors and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Ken with Village Green.